And so, in conclusion, it is important for us to be mindful of the fact that globalism is not a one-way street. You will not simply have McDonald's in Pakistan and uh, Colonel Sanders outside the Haram, by the way. Uh, if you've gone out there, you may have noticed that there's, there is um, a Kentucky outside the, the precincts of, of, of the sacred mosque. And if you stand at that particular Kentucky, you can actually see the sacred mosque. So that's the kind of proximity. So that's the West leaking into Islamdom. The reverse is also happening. It is as troubling for Muslims to have Western ideas, Western icons, Western establishments cre create a presence in the Islamic world as much as it is for the British to even consider having Islamic law or elements thereof as part of their social structure. But it's inevitable. What we have to do is work towards a modis vivendi that would recognize the rights of people to live their lives in accordance with their consciences, but not to the detriment of any other individual's rights and, 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 and liberties. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask.